Hi, my name's Daniel, and in this video I'll be helping you to get started with the Zen Developer Cloud. The Zen Developer Cloud, as its name suggests, is a cloud-based environment designed to help you code more quickly and more efficiently. It includes a robust PHP stack, advanced debugging capabilities, collaboration tools, and much more. And to make it even better, it's absolutely free. If you're interested in more info, check out phpcloud.com. In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up your first Zen Developer Cloud container. A Zen Developer Cloud container includes an instance of Zen Server, deployed applications, and a MySQL database. Each account is allowed two provision containers, which include launch snapshots of your containers. For info on working with snapshots, see the next Zen Developer Cloud video. Right, so let's get started. On the Zen Developer Cloud login page, I'm logging in using my Zend account credentials. Since this is the first time you'll be accessing the Zend Developer Cloud, you'll first need to set up your first container. To create the container, we first need to enter a name and password for the new container. Then, we need to select which Zen server we would like the new container to include. Each instance comes with a different PHP stack. The next step is optional. We can configure an outgoing email server for sending system notifications from the Zen Developer Cloud. Once we've finished filling in all the details, all we have to do now is click Create Container. The new container is provisioned and will be listed in the Containers list. To access and manage the container, click the container name. The Zen Server user interface is displayed, showing us the container overview page. This page gives us an overview of the container and also lists any deployed applications we have. A new container will include a default application which is basically an empty PHP app. You can deploy new applications by clicking the Deploy Application button in the Action Bar. Just select which kind of application you want to deploy, either an empty PHP app or a ready-made app, enter its name and path, and click Deploy New Application. The Applications list displays the base URL of the application. Let's access it to take a look. Using the Management page, you can access your MySQL database using phpMyAdmin Enable or disable Zen Server code tracing for the container Configure mail settings Change your container password Reset the container or delete it The Snapshots page allows you to create the exact image of your container, a great way to share your development work with other developers. Check out the Next Zen Developer Cloud video for more info on this feature. That's it for now. For more information on working with the Zen Developer Cloud, please see the online documentation at zen.com. 